Okay, welcome everybody. Um, we can set our motivation together with the refuge and buddy tutor prayer. Sangye Chadan Sagye Chanam La Changja Padu Dani Kapsuji Dagi Chanyang Gipe Sognam Ki Jala Penshi Sangye Trubarsh Sangye Chadan Sagye Chanam La Changja Padu Dagni Kapsuji Dagi Chanyang Gipe Sognam Ki Jola penshi sangge tru parlor shi Sangge tru dan sogge tru nam la Jang tru padu dagni kyap su chi Dagi tru nyeng ki pe sog nam ki Jola penshi sangge tru parlor Reverently I prostrate with our body, speech and mind We present clouds of every type of offering, actual and imagined we declare all our negative actions accumulated since beginningless time and rejoice in the merit of all holy and ordinary beings. Please remain until the end of cyclic existence and turn the wheel of dharma for living beings. We dedicate our own merits and those merits of others to the great enlightenment. Oh,
Katala welcomes you all to Tashita. Loma Zigla and Kongi and Kimbeta, Konaba, Tushita, and Konaba Tamaji, and Ji, Yungrosi, Yungrosi, Sibabo, Lasso, 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 Chambata Zevigor, Changusim Gordon, Jolin Cherishan, Shin de Tajiche, Jubi, and Nada Uti, that in the Zachim with Tindizima, Mela Shiaji, Tindizi, Zachim Bujakaya, you married the Hina young, and in the Chi, Katsoro, that Changu is in the Dratu at some genie, Shindumbe, Gatin Che, Jui. Uh, so um, uh, I apologize, first of all, take the opportunity to, to apologize because Tishita has been asking for me. Uh, it's been a long time since I've been here and Tishita has been um, sort of requesting me to come many times and I've kind of sort of said in, as they would say in Tibetan, lasso, lasso, but it hasn't, um, which means I, I, I'll try to come. But it mean, uh, but um, I'm very, uh, very happy to be here today to have this opportunity uh, to meet with you all and um, um, and uh, to talk a little bit about uh, the topics of compassion, loving kindness, and also the awakening mind of bodhicitta. And um, I don't have any uh, special understanding of these particular topics, but um, I, f I feel myself fortunate to be a person who has uh, even to have heard the the word, the, the the words of the awakening mind, or the the word of bodhicitta. So, um, so I'm very happy to be here and to talk about these things today. Uh, so um, even in a sort of normal context of ordinary people, then um, it, it, it's still, uh, ordinary people still place a, a high value on um, uh, topics such as, you know, uh, sort of as things such as loving compassion and uh, uh, loving kindness and compassion. And all, uh, you can say there's nobody that doesn't really feel that uh, life is not uh, sort of, you know, that they're really essential, um, in, uh, indispensable to a kind of ordinary life. Even ordinary people think in this way. <laughs> Uh, so, you know, and uh, so these are really incredible kinds of uh, minds, the minds of, of loving kindness and the minds of compassion. And, you know, the, the, all sentient beings, uh, as, uh, all sentient beings wish for um, happiness and uh, all sentient beings wish to not have to suffer um, and they, everyone enjoys, uh, you know, to have a kind of pleasant, comfortable, uh, happy feelings. Everyone enjoys this. So, th so, th so these are really important parts of, uh, you know, the, the, the greatness of uh, things such as um, loving kindness and compassion. uh, but uh, of course, it, it, the, we all wish for those things. We wish to, the, the, the wish, for, the wish for happiness uh, in all sentient beings is there, and the wish for uh, to be uh, separated from suffering. But of course, if we stray away from those um, things which bring that, such as loving kindness and compassion, and stray into uh, um, 
mental states such as um, uh, c- uh, clinging, attachment, and uh, kind of anger and aversion, then that's where um, that, although we wish for, uh, wish for happiness, that will bring us, uh, that, will bring it, that will lead us into suffering. Mm. So, so, you know, we, this is easy to see with the young children how they um, initially they're, 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 there's a kind of natural tendency towards um, kindness and loving kindness and compassion, these kind of mental states. But slowly, as you know, it's it's easy to observe that slowly you see that uh, the the there's an, there can be a sort of as, as they as the children become older that they they they're influenced more by um, uh, aversion, attachment. Ignorance, and so these, uh, as those increase in us, then it's a, a natural process that the uh, the uh, uh, compassion, loving kindness, those kind of states of mind uh, start to reduce as 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 we get uh, we get further influenced by um, aversion, attachment, ignorance, these kind of negative states. <laughs> Mm-hmm. So it's really an important um, time to, to uh, this time is a really important time to focus on uh, really uh, extending and uh, increasing within the, the kind of uh, the, our world environment uh, the states of uh, loving compassion and kindness, these, these kind of positive states, because if not, uh, and these are not uh, sort of uh, focused on and, and uh, enhanced, uh, within this world, then uh, this, this is going to lead us to a fear of, uh, sorry, a, a time of uh, great uh, fear and great suffering uh, lies ahead of us if we don't uh, focus on these things. So then, so then we have to, but this, you know, then we have to look at how we're going. How is that going to happen? Uh, what are the, uh, with kind of supportive reasoning behind it to see how that will take place? So then we have to really look into uh, what are the uh, what are the supportive causes and conditions w- which would be employed in order to help uh, uh, love and compassion and loving kindness and compassion flourish in the world what are the causes and conditions uh, we need to think about the reasons behind this mm. So, um, if, and of course, uh, there would be no opportunity for the, uh, the, the these kind of refined states of mind, like uh, the awakening mind of bodhicitta, to arise if we're not if these uh, basic building blocks are not in place beforehand. <laughs> Mm. So so 
So really, this is, you know, these states of mind are so um, incredible. And if we just if we just take the context of our our, our own uh, present lives and the health of our um, own lives, if we uh, if we practice and uh, practice love and loving kindness and compassion, then uh, our health is uh, greater improved. There's less illness. Uh, we t uh, we live a we, we may live a longer. It's possible to live a longer life. That we there may be sort of greater contentment and general happiness throughout our lives, and also then applying this not just to ourselves but within the context of our uh, families and the, the relationships between uh, you know within a family between children and parents, um, and the, the 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 greater that the um, the. The, these states of love and compassion are in our in this context and there's there's also a greater kind of sense of um a, a kind of relaxed trust between people and uh, and everyone is um, generally more comfortable and then if we take that from that context of the family context and then so from an individual to the family and then employing these things throughout society and through uh, you know and then societies countries and then out into the wider world, then we can see that uh, the development, the, the, the increase in uh, loving compassion and kindness, uh, loving kindness and compassion uh, throughout the world would would uh, bring greater peace, uh, greater uh, greater health and comfort to the body, greater peace to the mind, and perhaps also reduce the number of kind of obstacles that occur in people's lives. <laughs> So also we can see within the, this uh, world uh, with with the all, all the great religious traditions of the world and and the and the founders the founding uh, teachers of of those uh, great religious traditions would would always uh, praise uh, loving kindness, compassion, particularly compassion, loving kindness, and uh, all of them state how uh, it's of tremendous benefit uh, uh, to oneself and others. So this is this is very common even throughout all of the great religious traditions of the world. <laughs> So and and this is you know when we people who are seen to be of good heart of of, of great heart or great kindness um, or uh, who do who embody these qualities we always they're looked on as people who have quality they are people of great quality you know that they have uh, qualities to them so because of their uh, kind heartedness their love and their compassion. <laughs> So there can't be many people that really, everybody wants uh, at least for others to treat them well. Nobody wants to be treated badly. And probably most people even do have a wish to treat others well and to not treat others badly. So this is kind of a natural state of things. So, but there are great, you know, within the with, with saying that people are good or kind-hearted, that has a many different kind of levels of of strength and also uh, of a kind of ability or potential within them. So it's not it's not it's it's very diverse. Yeah, so when things are when we haven't when we're not meeting difficulties and uh, things are going well for us then it's it's relatively easy for us to um, to feel kind-hearted uh, to have patience and um, the, these are the kind of positive qualities uh, when uh, when we're not faced with uh, complications and difficulties. So, 
Kangi Tuna, the Nichamba de Zevillo, Gomna, and Susugi, and he be simply Durdu at a Gomashi resort at a Kangtar, and the same day, and he bet in Jubatine, go Mevacharu was. So, but it's 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 easily seen that uh, when the unconducive and complicated conditions come into our lives, then at that time it's easy for uh, the either the strength or indeed the the of our loving kindness, our compassion, our our patience, these positive states, uh, to be easily eroded. Uh, and even to uh, even for the mind to be uh, completely kind of. Uh, altered or carried away, and f even for those uh, positive things to be uh, destroyed, this is quite easy to see. Tainza, that she shall love John Karazina. Jutum bitone, Jibu Mingozi, Yimba Songzang, Energy, Chanjugisim, Layaji, Tachimbo, the Nazo, Gurbiji, Chanjugisim, Layadi, Chanjugsim, Layadi, Karazi Imenda, Tijin, Giva Karazi, you met, and this day. Yeah, so, um, uh, of course, and, and so we have to think about, uh, we also have to think in this context about uh, how things are, how, how those states of mind arise. So, for instance, uh, the, the, this, this incredible uh, mind, the awakening mind of uh, bodhicitta, and uh, we have to, it, it's produced, these these. Uh, states are produced in uh, relying on conditions in accord uh, with the particular with the causes in condition with the result of the, the resulting mind these resulting positive minds so for instance with bodhicitta we have to sort of ask what's what bodhicitta is what's it like what does it mean and ha uh, and and uh, sort of look into how how is it produced uh, in in co accord with its causes and conditions ตาเงินเจ้าเจ้าละอันนี้จีงั้นเนี่ยฉันบอกแต่เจ้าเวลาจะเช่นบ่จะยังอะไรอันนี้ที่เกี่ยงกันได้คันดีไหมเป็นอ
under and and therefore with the uh, kind of overwhelmed to some extent by the uh, the three poisons of uh, attachment in, aversion and ignorance uh, then they have to necessarily go under the sway of uh, the suffering of suffering and the suffering of change. These are a necessary part of their existence. If we were to, uh, if we were to change that and to, to, uh, to, so that our, our view and our conduct, uh, the, the view that we had of the nature of reality was known well and was unmistaken, and therefore on the basis of that our our practice of conduct and behavior were also unmistaken, then that's the, play, the place where we start to, in, when we talk about uh, Jantra Gisem, the, the mind of enlightenment, and we talk about enlightenment, that's the place where we engage with the path that leads us, on, uh, leads us to enlightenment. Laya so um in terms uh, so also um as Katola said before also the, even even if someone is a sentient being even though you may have attained a, what we term as a precious human rebirth that, that's still under the sway of the uh, the the three poisons and the mistaken un, mistaken view and mistaken conduct you experience suffering um uh, even uh, but in this precious human rebirth whether you were um Mm, not necessarily uh, being a, a Buddhist or a non-Buddhist, uh, whichever, um, but it's still, to some extent, uh, wisdom is um, is still kind of valued. There's a sense in which uh, un understanding and wisdom are valued, and um, and to uh, if we think what the way we should think about uh, wisdom, and certainly in the context of uh, uh, Certainly, in the context of uh, the, the path to enlightenment, is this, this it, we we should think of wisdom as a path. It's a, a path which is very uh, extremely uh, kind of vast and deep, and and uh, something of of incredible value to to have in our lives. Um, even, as I say, even if uh, the people being Buddhist or non-Buddhist, but still we have this uh, these kind of innate. Uh, wishes not to, to to avoid suffering. We wish to have feel, uh, pleasant uh, feelings and happiness, have pleasant and happy uh, feelings and experiences. We, we wish to avoid unpleasant and uncomfortable and uh, feelings and experiences. And so, um, oh, yes. And so, but and so that's a kind of natural process, even as a non as a non-Buddhist, but if we're talking about the path which leads us uh, uh, to enlightenment and, and the awakening mind, then what we do is we start to look at what the, uh, the primary uh, kind of uh, block, uh, obstacle to that occurring is, which is the, uh, um, what's called chinjilog below in Tibetan. It means that literally the completely inverted mind, the mind which sees... Um, uh, sees the nature of things in a completely inverted, mistaken way. Chinji 
And so, uh, so uh, you you are all people who've had a, a very good education, and um, and people who are used to kind of analysing and checking things. So, there it's very important in this in this context that we're talking here to analyse what is. Look for yourself. It's very important for us to come up face to face with what and identify what are the what is the root the, the root causes of um, suffering. So in the in the Buddhist text in the Buddhist context they will say that for sentient beings the root cause of their um, but this is something for you to identify and look for yourself. But the the root causes of uh, suffering for a sentient being are essentially. This this mistaken view, uh, the mistaken view of reality, this uh, uh, inverted kind of fully mistaken kind of way of not seeing the true nature of things, and uh, uh, what also happens uh, through through that uh, from that view is a uh, what's called a kind of inappropriate engagement, uh, in, in concordant engagement with the nature of reality, which then drives on the process of. Uh, the arisal of our um, of uh, such uh, negative emotions as as uh, atta- uh, strong clinging attachment, and and uh, and also and, and apply uh, conjoined with all of this is our uh, this mistaken v- view also entails us uh, clinging to things as though they exist in a kind of intrinsic inherent way, which then drives the process of our suffering. So this is how it's presented in the text. Mm. <laughs> Uh, so if yeah so if um is so uh, if based on you know through this kind of uh, mistaken view uh, <laughs> where, we, where we get um uh, <laughs> and the um uh, this kind of um this clinging this grasping and clinging at uh, attachment and uh, this kind of uh, mis- fully mistaken views um, then, even if we are to make, um, even if we are sort of uh, engaged in kind of uh, good-hearted uh, kind of acts, then if if we are to sort of make the prayers about how all you know, may I uh, see all sentient beings as as uh, kind of uh, all the sort of as as uh, vast as the uh, the sky filled with the sentient beings, may I see all these sentient beings as uh, as being my uh, uh, parents or my mother, but somehow, with that underpinning of the kind of uh, grasping and clinging, there's somehow there's no there's a it's not possible to fit that kind of sense into our minds. The the sense that the idea that we all sentient beings could be our mothers is more difficult for us to acculturate ourselves to. <laughs> So there's no doubt, though, that if we were to understand this uh, presentation uh, uh, of of how uh, from the from the the Dharma presentation of how things uh, arise in a dependently related way, and that there's not a single uh, atom of, from the, from the side of the from the ob- from the phenomena. It, with the phenomena have not a single atom of a uh, kind of inherent or e- existence from their own side, then there's no doubt that all, uh, these uh, uh, the uh, ex- attachment and uh, aversion uh, would fade away. <laughs> Chadang 
Suzuki, Jacobina, Suzuki, Chadan, Logesa, Karazina, and it be took to Bazi, and a bed, Temberzin de Vazi, Lodzi, Yungoros. Then digging on it, and Suzuki, Namto, Jujay Mamma, she seen it, then Chadangi, lowing on it, then Dungin Conamado, Tamade, Nick of Devayana, Deba Devan de Ude, Yungandi, Dungin Madoni, Yunga Mavazi Chaguro. So this uh, this con uh, confused process is is what uh, even though that we wish to have uh, uh, we wish to have happiness we don't wish to have suffering, but um, when uh, attachment and aversion uh, is, uh, arise in us, then we have you know for instance with attachment to, or anger to uh, our attachment to our country for instance. Uh, then there's this very uh, uh, self, uh, it's very sense of great uh, kind of substantial, self-substantial kind of self, which is a, a solid kind of self, and um, and so based uh, with that in mind, and then with all the kind uh, um, kind of mixtures of causes and conditions, and our and the our kind of uh, kind of conceptual thinking that springs out of all of that, even though we're naturally not wishing to have suffering and we're wishing to have happiness, the, 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 there's only one result, and that is the result that we end up uh, suffering through our misunderstanding. Changjuki sem, laya de la, and Jim Zen, the Demitone, and then Ji Rang Jinzi, laya de, then go guni, Dogja imba, and then Jen Jinzi, Chia de la, and then Chamata Zebelo, Lana, Gain Chimbo, Kurtumi, and then Sem de Jachimbo, Sem de Changbo, Sem de Dembaji Kalandogres. So um, so again, this uh, kind of mistaken kind of way, mistaken views and mistaken kind of minds uh, are, are common to us. But if we were to, um, if perhaps we are fortunate enough uh, uh, through contact with our, uh, our, our kind of uh, our teachers and uh, our spiritual teachers and, and guides, um, and perha uh, perhaps there's a, some kind of small imprint that is uh, from that, if we were able to see uh, the sort of uh, the 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 benefits of uh, minds such as the awakening mind, uh, and and when we were to hear of um, uh, when we when we think about something like the self uh, self cherishing mind, uh, then we would maybe have an a kind of automatic response of seeing it as kind of. Uh, uh, negative and uh, it, and and when we hear of uh, or uh, or hear of or develop uh, minds the mind cherishing others instead, we might think of it as uh, something very positive, uh, something very um, vast and kind of straight or honest and stable. So perhaps through some small imprints from contact with our uh, spiritual guides. Mm. Tawada, Japani, the Zungjin, the Kazorata, Chi Tapshini, Sungroa, then Dini Zungjin, Susu Mizijo, the Pekish Murindua. So it's really important for us to uh, kind of live, live our lives through this uh, kind of uh, union or kind of uh, union of um, uh, 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 the correct view and, and, and also uh, of uh, a positive conduct based. Uh, based upon that, so the, the, there we have a kind of. This is also essentially a kind of union of kind of method, and then also of wisdom. And these, through this process, is how we should live our lives. So if we have this view of this the view in the in the way that phenomena appear in a kind of dependently originating, appendently related way, then this really gives us a kind of vast kind of outlook into life. Uh, it's uh, hard for us to anger. It's easier for us to practice patience. It's uh, 
uh, in developing concent you know, concentration, uh, it's, it, it seems to be easier for us to develop concentration. So the, uh, and so it's uh, such a kind of uh, huge kind of positive influence with, uh, with this underpinning of the view of dependent origination. So, but if we if we follow the other path of uh, under the under the sway of the mistaken view, then and that kind of drives us through into sort of uh, uh, over kind of self cherishing, and then whatever we do in life, for instance, you know whether it be sort of a, a career or a, in an education field. We're kind of driven by um, a kind of our, our mind becomes very small, and uh, it becomes a very kind of tight and uh, kind of um, what's the word? <laughs> very kind of obstinate and kind of tight way of thinking, and, and we're, we're we're very much more absorbed in our own kind of uh, the, the happiness for ourselves and our own kind of success and. Uh, Driven again under this sway of this mistaken uh, view of reality. Mm. And then this really creates our own suffering because what's happening is that it's not not only uh, uh, sort of you know just the, not just for self cherishing but this sense of we become uh, much more dishonest it's very easy for us to be much more divisive in the way that we deal with uh, people or things that we don't like with aver uh, with easily with aversion and the things that we uh, those uh, things which are very close to us with a strong sense of attachment and then this uh, this uh, completely drives our process of suffering ジェンラテネゲゲンセムジェンマモチグラトクタムヨンソゾバヤボシジュルムテワイナサマペミシカジンチェンボジェドレスイナンデハマゴネニツイチンチグラアニチカズソソジエナンツイラランチゴジェン
achieve those things ourselves, and, and yet we have this, self, this sense of uh, almost like self-isolation. It's just like we who did it. So we need a kind of, and that's the way they appear to us. That sometimes that's how it appears to us, that we, we just did it all alone. And uh, we need a strong sense of gratitude uh, to others for uh, the part that they played in when we do have successes. Mm. So you have to, there's no way that any of this could occur from, from birth all the way to death. It, it's everything that uh, occurs essentially uh, has to have uh, relied on others along the way. Uh, so the, yeah, so therefore, um, we have to also think of the, all the sentient beings as being in, in, incredible, uh, this sense of gratitude towards them. Chambada <laughs> And so, um, in terms of something like having a good heart, uh, it's not enough for us to, it, it, it's not enough for us to just say the word, so to speak, to, for to make these uh, incredible prayers that we find in, in, you know, about wishing for all sentient beings to have happiness. Um, Okay, there's, it's, it's, it's a, there's not, it's not a bad thing, it's okay, but um, it's, it's very easy for that to become uh, just dry words, and that alone doesn't uh, qualify for being uh, good-hearted. Good what being good-hearted means is to look back to the kind of uh, mental states that we had before and see how... Uh, we've been able to change those by applying uh, relative kind of an uh, the, the re relevant sorry antidotes and see how uh, from from seeing seeing how we were before and then seeing the need to change and then applying the antidotes that's what it means uh, in this context to have a good heart <laughs> Any Tangzi Sawandi, Dig <laughs> We need to 
我也是通说了,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在那么多人,就在
this process, particularly of uh, mis misapprehending uh, something which has no intrinsic self to have a self, uh, then comes in this kind of inner, in, in, uh, incon incongruent sort of way of uh, engaging with reality. Uh, this drives uh, the, the poisons of uh, attachment and uh, uh, aversion or hatred, and there'll be no end uh, to the problems of our lives. Um, if we were able to basically revert, uh, um, to reverse this, pro this, process, this process by, so what this highlights is the need for us to see through to the nature of reality and to understand uh, the mistaken nature of our understanding. And then if we were able to um, uh, cut away uh, the, uh, the, the, the root, uh, cutting, cutting this away at the root of the mistaken understanding, and also this will also help us in, in terms of, um, this also helps us, uh, these understandings of uh, impermanence and uh, the lack of intrinsic reality also help us in, our, in relation to other sentient beings uh, because it, it, it actually spurs on our compassion. So our, the self-cherishing that we, it, which also springs out of these uh, mistaken ways of uh, seeing the world then help us to understand, oh, you know, the other... Uh, Sentient beings are like me. They're in the same. They're in the same kind of trap as I've been. They've fallen into the same misunderstanding as I've fallen in, and um, and then we, uh, you know, if we if we sort of broaden that out, that uh, uh, if if you're let's say you're practicing these things and starting to understand them, then when you see other sentient beings, you will see them. Uh, with compassion for uh, the fact that you see the suffering that comes from not understanding the reality uh, and you feel that they can also, uh, just as I have started to understand the way things are, they can also do the same and we expand that out to the uh, kind of how in Buddhism we talk about the six, uh, six different realms which are inhabited by sentient beings. Of course, we only manifestly have access to uh, the human and the animal realm, um, but this um, uh, this uh, so, so we can see them in that compassionate way, um, and so what happens is, and and you also in a, in a much broader context, the, the sense of the um, misunderstandings and correcting all of those misunderstandings, allowing us to completely, uh, uh, the ability to complete, that we, we could all have the ability to completely remove all of those misunderstandings, which would lead us uh, on the path to enlightenment. And so our compassion, once we have these understandings, it gets deeper and deeper. If, and, and this is not uh, uh, kind of overcome by when difficulties are, uh, fall upon us, uh, the, we don't get uh, sort of straight, we don't, it doesn't sort of disturb us because what it does is the difficulties and our understanding of the nature of things drives more, it, it, it creates in us more patience and uh, greater compassion. It's the, it's the, mo it's the most wonderful of uh, forms of compa uh, passion and com uh, compassion and patience. And um, and so, we, so the whole. So at the end, we understand that the uh, the way that uh, the, the, the the tremendous importance of understanding uh, the way that things exist on all of these different levels. Rangdu samno madan chine, jindu samno dan jin chedala, an susu lega kharizina ta chik jin la pen toa sho, ani to ke tam ni su kharizi chesun kharizi lega ja chesun kharizina ngeji dering ani lega te ani kharizina ta jin la te le jin la pen toa sho lega di la te ni deva yuci samalo sema zambo yunga sho, ani. Kajigurgo, 
Ani leju ledan ji bari de gulu ji cha bar ge ani ji ji bu de za chin bu de cha ya. Ah so the so the um even if we not to fully under, uh, immediately fully understand all of these uh, sort of levels of, of nature of reality and um, even if we weren't to, to do that but even throughout our uh, daily lives um, whatever we're doing whether it's education or work or whatever we're engaged in um, one of the ways to uh, create a sort of th- this good heart and also to actually for ourselves to create a, a vast kind of, uh, for ourselves and others to create a vast kind of uh, resultant kind of fruit is to um, think that you're not it, it, so everything motivation is key to all of this so uh, to have the motivation that whatever you're doing engage with uh, whatever kind of activities there are whatever it's related to uh, that we would, uh, we're not doing them for our uh, our own selfish purposes. That uh, we uh, would ha- would aspire that uh, whatever we're doing is beneficial and uh, cr- provides benefit and happiness uh, for others. Uh, and this is uh, this is the good heart. We would uh, wish that um, whatever we're doing that. Uh, for ourselves and others, that the uh, the, the kind of three poisons of attachment, uh, ignorance, or aggression, uh, of aversion or aggression, and um, uh, ignorance are uh, are reduced, and and so actually, what happens is, if we do this, the work that we do at that time is the same. The job is the, the job is the same, or the study is the same. Whatever it is you're engaged in is the same, but. There's a huge difference um, because of the uh, different kinds of motivation that we bring to do that. Mm. Tawashushi, Changuk is same like the Kandisi Changuome, Kandisi Chuguome, Della Rang, Guba Hasesome, Sachimu Kareim and Digi Digi Karitegome, Rang, and Nick of the Tatula, Deva Hasis Tegome, Jean Nick of the Tatula, Deva Hasis Tegome, Tikukarimi, Tikian Karimi, Dennis in the Gavishini, Dongoyadang, and in Dendis, Dunni Gavishini de la Yang, Sachimuje, and the big Kujab Segore Lama, Don Jig Ladremado, Jig. Top time Kaiser <laughs> Tai 
de kale kale zuni chewa ina ani da jukbe chanju ge semzela na wo su 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 ge da semje tamje sanji ji khomba rumbu ji ge gin te ge wala teni parchin tu gi nyane je ne ani sherab de paru de chimba yonsu do ba nyane je gi se di su su wo su nyane je gi se sungo ro da te nyane je wala di yon de de ha go na ga jen je gire nga zo cho je mi ina cho ke san je bo ina de la ma je wala na ko ga jen je ne me se de la pe go se de ria ti cha de yo ba ina de ru tam tam ani khaju ma jun kala do de do ha ise ko ko top cha tim bu zu yo ro a ta chan juk sem ge de pe yun da so so sem chang bo da sem zang bo da cha chim bo ni ka cho ye na la mi se na la ni re cho ye na la tar du ani ge wa ni ge wa yong su zo bo la de ji de ya ji cha chin zi so so mi tong la si zi ni ha ko na an de la ga jin chi re de la zu nen chi re chi ko ya re e ji cha ba ra ta di chi ya la ma zu mi lu de la sa zi la sem jin su ji chi tu ge men do a uh so um uh so uh the so the what's important is the sort of understanding um uh sorry oh, that, that's a bit over before <laughs> um so uh when we're talking about the awakening mind and you know particularly in the in the in this uh, buddhist context we talk about the uh, of the awakening mind of bodhicitta there we talk about the um aspirational uh, awakening mind and then we all talk about the awakening mind which actually uh, manifestly engages in the uh, practices of the bodhisattva path and uh, right at the beginning what we have to do is understand what are the what's sort of what's the point of it what are the advantages of it what what does it mean um uh, if we if we don't understand what the qualities of it are uh uh what what's the purpose in in uh, uh striving to give rise to those kind of uh, states of mind uh then if we don't really know what they are and what the purpose is and and what the benefits are and the qualities are then it's very difficult for us uh to give rise to those in our own minds um it, 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 you can see it easily uh evidenced examples in 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 like for instance in a in a business context if you were um if you saw the advantages uh, or or in uh, you know uh, something that we wish to um uh, buy for instance and, and if we saw the great advantages or qualities of it and then we would um uh, then we would make in a, in a regular life context we would spend we would work hard in order to obtain that and the, um apart from a, maybe a day off a week we would hardly have any spare time to do anything else because we saw um uh the advantages of what we wanted to purchase so with with the awakening mind then it's uh we should look at what the all of these co- the, the context what is it what is it about why why is it why do it, why is it valued and considered so great what kind of happiness does would it give to us uh both in the short term and in the long term um and um uh then uh, what kind of uh, causes and conditions does it uh, arise from so this is kind of uh, seeing the both the need for it uh but also um uh seeing the need for it but also understanding uh, clearly about it and how it's given uh, how we give rise to it um then and um kan kan sosugi kan sosugi lamala sopa de dinsu de kasele dinsu de dns chik songore jan chik songore So and you know perhaps then we also go to our spiritual guides and teachers and and ask them what are, ask them further details about what are the um uh, what are the ways in which we abandon the kind of uh uh factors which would uh, are, are act as obstacles to it arising and and what are the uh, ways in which we develop the conducive conditions which allow us to develop uh, these kinds of minds um so not uh, going to them and relying on our spiritual teachers in that way in relation to um uh, the development of the say the awakening mind 
And actually, what we find uh, when we when this kind of when we work on developing this kind of mind is uh, that we're kind of wherever we go, there's a kind of sense of uh, uh, re relaxed kind of openness and happiness. Uh, it's it's like uh, these minds such as uh, compassion, loving kindness, uh, the awakening mind become like our uh, our uh, a kind of the own uh, our own house that we live in and take with us wherever we go, and uh, whenever we're engaged with uh, other sentient beings, then um, they're almost like. Uh, we can say something like our children or like our family. There's a, this sense of closeness, since they all uh, wish to have, uh, since they all wish to have happiness. They don't wish to have suffering, and the, um, uh, they're all in the nature of impermanence, selflessness, um, and uh, the, these kind, of, these kind of uh, conditions themselves. Then. Um, we so, so we feel sort of this this mind uh, wishing for them to have the highest of happinesses uh, is is sort of uh, we feel very sort of close to them also, um, and so looking at what what would be the, what's the benefits of wishing that uh, we could um, uh, place all of the sentient beings in the, uh, the the state of highest happiness, the fully enlightened state. Uh, what is the benefit? Of, uh, what are the benefits of that? And um, uh, is is it? Um, and you know what it does is, as I say, creates this relaxed kind of open and a vast kind of uh, sense of our minds. And it's almost impossible for um, anger and strong anger and attachment to actually arise when we have. Uh, so these are the kind of advantage uh, arise when when we're developing those kind of minds. So, um, and then that's you know. So there's the wish that we uh, are able to place all of the sentient beings in the enlightened, fully enlightened state. And then also then understanding the qualities of the in terms of the uh, engaged uh, awakening mind, which is the practice of the six perfections, which is, which is our real practice when we're talking about the awakened mind. The uh, the six perfections are our actual practice, um, and so it all is like as as many examples are there in real life. When we see the advantages and the qualities uh, of something in just in an ordinary context, then we it's very easy for us to engage in and pursue those things. So in the same way, uh, we should also sort of investigate and uh, sort of. Uh, come to understand more clearly about bodhicitta, uh, the awakening mind, in order to help us uh, kind of pursue and engage in it. Kang darada mise no la ji chamba da zere lo di ta ma zong mu wo ji na ne ta pu de chima de ren do as. And so it seems to me that you. Know, uh, yeah, it's the the the, the most uh, wonderful or the most uh, ama uh, the, the best of all um, kind of uh, ways of thinking and ways of acting. Uh, it must be uh, the loving kindness and compassion. This must be the best of all in our lives. Mm -hmm. Any <laughs> Rankawandro Tessun 
Shira Peje Madame Aina Yang, Samre Dugum Mugum Raje, Aksa Raje, Anigi, Chamba da Zevelo, Des Desi, Seba, the Des Desi Nima, Kashi, Dawa Kashi, Lokashini, Lokta Jeti Yungdoa. Tesune Susu Chuchi, Tembarina, Chu, Laedi, G. Miriki Nisu Maimba, and in same years, the Gugola, Chula, and the Jeti, and Susu Tungi Mandeva, Lok, Dukjati Su Jeti. Ani Deva ye jute to Tamalo to Katso Zang Zangjang. Ani Kangder Ani Tawa Chinji Loya Dang, Joba Chinji Lo Deva Tini De, Ani Chinji Malowi, Tawa Chi, the Chinji Malowi, Joba Zi, Lesson Aina, and then Song De Ta Tarwa Sena, Tamji Chimbi Comba Laedi, Dinia, Drotagidua, Dome Serva. Te yungala la matini ta demba zita so so teba ta mugu yiji te yang she ni teba to yang ni droba ina te ni gom jao na gom ju yo wat gom la na gom ji te yang ra gom ji kare te ngore da yang dangji mari pa da rang jin jin ni di ngara la ne drao yin ba ne cha yin ba pe mi si ne ka ta tu ka tu ina da je ina ra du ina ra ta pe mi si ji dok ja de su re se na rang yi dangji Rang Jinzin, oh, Dini Digi, Rang la Nudeva, so what dungi, Jen la Nudeva, so what dungi. Dini de, ta may be lord the tongue, Jen Jinzin ye low, Chamba the zero lord the shes on aina, Tinny shed in it, come to deny. Ah, Dini de, Nidawa, Calecale, Calecale, com, Tombo Tevache, Tinny some young qua, Calecale, com, Tinny G. So she knew a gallo, lived with any two me color, less on aina, then he cow and draw aina, same jay carina, pama, cow a levaina, pie, rangi, you must so by to green it's a carriage and dela, rangi, ninja tongue droids. Namjung as a ninja senna, and the jay dog is pung there, chur make it tongue as ye, same jay ninja, tachi, dongy chadia zero, dela ninja ra. Dico, Sessions, you know. Tatanda ninja to the day. So, so, drala ninja. Nila ninja, drala ninja. Tama law, zambling dicala. Semje, dungi mandeva, devan deva yonsu zovala. Jap duni, gun duni, pung duni. Rangi mik sunganaji. Semje tamala. Sungoaji, so so le nuba. So so la yichi. Semje tamje nendini, tindigi. Sem zachim buzi dang, sem chang buzi dang, and a jabba zang buzi, loy color. Candice in the lemon jimaru. Die till lay a chedula, go gun the chawa candice chip. They in the name? Parching troop. De tinny dada, seba, seba chivaina, putuchuma. Oh, jimba domaina, putuchuma. Jimba domaina, rang top jada, kuja mari, sem jetam jenny, sem trubatish ya chedula. Sim Truba, she gets you to Saba, Jim Zen Dangji, Rang Daji, Dinningi, a young Rangji Maduba Toyn, Jim Zen, Sachin Bujanjan, Jing Udo. Tessons on the Dinner the Chewaina, Tenny Be Kawa, Kadu, Kareina, Chawa Yonsu Zoba, Susula, Gangi Chiaji, Chawa Yomarita, Sim Nan, Ninchi Chiata, Semba Zambu Zoya Dita, Dinner the Gani, Juju Dangina, Sachin Budo, De Yungala, and then see Tajaji Tumba Sachin Buda. Cazzoro, Sanji jumped in the Yuma, Tongi Shivachi, Gunju Pangwachi, and then Lam Gombachi Goba went to Chi, so he entered the Tama Loa, Cora, Cora, Petaji Goba went to Chi, Laddy, Pa Yen, like a member, Sanji, Laddy, Rangi, same Rangindi, same Jesus, so ye, same ye, Rangian, same ye, Niluk. One name, much of the Shes or in Go Goba Tirido, Sanji Tirido. That dig no initiative, Matomachi, no initiative, Nima Dorazin, not so timber door signal, chingy. Then a timber door de petty, that shallow no so yons to all a chingy, chingy, and a dela chatan zinny, and a go, Ji, Nima Yerdena, Timbezi, chings and a tongue mirror, then Nanji, semi Janji de Tonsona, then a jipaku, turned over. Shell and Gia Gio Marie, Gail and Jig Dryo Marie, Naya the Jig Dryo Marie. Tama Loco. Then the two gunny shards on the river. Shards on the river. Then Bazure, then Badi Carrizena, two to be gun. This a dingy gun, Jujin, a tenny, two to chuning on the yashare. 
Jujin and Tene, due to Chuningana, ma jiggery. Coran Chujin, Coran Sharva Nini, Jibon was the troops on it. Dilla, Masu Yichiada, Masu Yitzi, Manju Chiada, Masu Yi, Chatang Zoeji, Jim Hindua. Caraca was you, Ra. Tanga, Kitchen, you like it. And so, um, and so then we're sort of, uh, if we have these, uh, so seeing, as we were talking about seeing the qualities and, and then having a sort of, uh, you know, interest to engage in these things, uh, and then, um, uh, we, uh, if we uh, engage in the practices of the the, uh, the, the bodhisattva path, such as the six perfections, um, uh, there is uh, there's no there there there's no f- sort of there's no kind of difficulties or fears for arise with us in, uh, when we um, they only inspire us to uh, have patience and altruism and. Um, but if we, so that's a path based in uh, the understanding of how things are. Uh, but if we uh, have the other, we go the other route where we don't understand uh, uh, the way in things in which things exist, then there are, um, uh, there's tremendous uh, fears and difficulties that arise for us. The, um, with, the, with, that, with lacking wisdom, uh, there's a very strong uh, sort of, engagement with uh, the, the self-grasping mind, the mind, the kind of egoistic self-grasping mind, and then also the kind of selfish, self-cherishing uh, minds, and then the, the, based on those, the, uh, the ignorance, attachment, aversion, wrong views, jealousy, um, competitiveness, all of these uh, things uh, come out. It's, it's like we're kind of uh, it's like we're through this misunderstanding. It's like we're bound within uh, uh, the, the misunderstanding of the, uh, the the wrong. Sorry, the wrong conduct and with the wrong conduct and the mistaken conduct and mistaken view, uh, mistaken view and mistaken conduct. Then it's like we're uh, bound within a kind of uh, prison um, uh, of of all of this uh, cycle of uh, negativity. And what we need is a kind of um, but we also need to. This, this needs to be grounded uh, in reason, uh, uh, in in uh, the, the the faith that we have in these things needs to be grounded in reason. And if uh, if we're, it, it's it's not something that just uh, we do for a few days because without being grounded in reason and only sort of engaging in in these things for a short time, um, without the backup of kind of reason. It it uh, it very quickly fades away. Um, the word in Tibetan for the the Dharma is uh, chur. The the Dharma um, has this uh, sense within it of um, uh, changing uh, of change of of the chain changing of the mind. And so um, what we what we you know so understand so for instance. Um, um, Engage, uh, changing the mind so that we engage in the cause. So, so with our wish uh, for uh, to avoid suffering and to have happiness, and then uh, we have to understand the sort of causes and conditions which which, uh, which help us to do that. Um, uh, with a, and then in, engaging in the in uh, understanding that whole thing, and then engaging in those and changing our mind is what it means to have dharma practice. Um, if we if we're under the sway of the mistaken view, then it's it's very difficult for us um, to walk uh, the path to liberation. And one other important factor that is one factor, other important factor which is important here is in terms of kind of um, faith and or sort of aspiration, um, um, and then in terms of uh, meditation. Um, meditation ha- has a con- ha- has an understanding of, of being habituated or accustomed, uh, becoming accustomed to something. And what we have to habituate ourselves at all times to here is the understanding, 
and this is the way that we change our minds, the understanding that the, self, the self-grasping, the egoistic self-grasping view and the self-cherishing views are, are absolute enemies, that they not only, they are, uh, and the three poisons, self-grasping, self-cherishing, and the three poisons are things which are, they are our enemies. They harm not only ourselves, but they also harm others. And um, that's the kind of habit that we have to create of understanding that the, that is our enemy. And then also habituating ourselves uh, to wisdom and the understanding of the cor- uh, understanding that the way we see things is mistaken and understanding the correct view and uh, then in the basis of that engaging in correct conduct. And then what we do is... Uh, the process of meditation proceeds, well, first of all, by hearing or listening to teachings, then by uh, contemplating those, and uh, and then sort of cultivating familiarity uh, through meditation upon them. And at some point, they become almost, uh, they go from something which requires a lot of effort to something which is almost uh, effortless. Um, and and this is, uh, so this is the sort of way that we, um, proceed, uh, proceed forward. Um, uh, so we have to. So all sentient beings, not wishing to have um, uh, this, not wishing to have uh, suffering and wishing to have happiness, and uh, we should we should see others uh, through the eyes that we see ourselves. In the way that we see ourselves, we should also. Uh, see others in this way, and then the the um, correct kind of conduct and view, and then whatever, and, and then that that leads us with, with the sort of uh, the path of the the bodhisattva path through the sort of bodhicitta, uh, through to the um, practices uh, the, of the six perfections such as generosity, ethical conduct, uh, and patience, and these and these. With this uh, correct view, then these practices of the six perfections really become kind of complete and perfect um, through seeing that there is no intrinsic um, through see- so sorry so through through seeing that there's no intrinsic nature to phenomena and reality, then it's uh, then really in all of our activities. Uh, there's no problems don't arise at all. What happens is that uh, um, only only in, instead of the problem when problems come to us while we're practicing this path, it's only compassion that arises, and um, and then we have a, and then we sort of perhaps develop to some extent a reverence for the the teacher, the Buddha who taught these things, who said to us, "Look at your own suffering, uh, know the suffering." understand the causes of suffering or remove the causes of suffering, uh, manifest the cessation of that state, the suffering, the liberation, and, you know, and in order to do that, um, practice the path. And, and so when, and when we talk about here about manif- uh, manifesti- manifesting the c- state of cessation or liberation, uh, what we mean is in some sense, what is also being said is to understand the nature of mind uh, to um, to to see through to the nature of mind and uh, so for us we're uh, which would be the state where the the kind of sun is fully shining for us we're uh, kind of uh, the, these things we don't see these things clearly and they're hidden we're kind of hidden behind the hidden behind the clouds for us and we can't uh, see the the real nature of mind. Um, but understanding the true nature of mind, uh, the the truth of the dependently related nature of reality, and how, uh, in some way, uh, the mm, phenomena or experiences uh, all come uh, out of the through the dependently related nature. They come out of what we would call the dharma dhatu, the sphere of kind of reality, and almost. Um, Sort of then almost sort of dissolve back into that sphere of reality. If we have this uh, kind of faith uh, in uh, and understanding, then there will be no way for uh, negative states of mind, such as anger and strong attachment, to arise in us. Last, <laughs> 
Tadela, not the Tangman Law, Denny, Tuji any Jesian Tamba Tama could sit day and down, any Zamblin Semja Yonsu Zoba, any could sit day, Parchu Meva, any Chawa Kang, Chiva Tamaloa, any G. Gavichu so Yuela, Mendu, Gadinche. And so um, uh, uh, this kind of concludes my talk for today on the uh, uh, loving kindness and. Uh, 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 loving kindness and compassion, and uh, and uh, also I, I I encourage you at all times to uh, try to uh, work on methods which allow us to tame uh, the mistaken mind and to in, uh, enhance and uh, to allow to flourish the uh, positive states of loving kindness and compassion. Um, and I think that there were uh, so thank you to all of you today for uh, coming here to uh, listen to my. Uh, explanation and also I think there are probably quite a few people online as well so thank you very much for uh, taking the time uh, to to join us um, and may all of the uh, the the virtue the, po the positive virtue that comes from uh, or all of us listening and thinking about these things may that uh, uh, ripen uh, may all of the positive benefits of that ripen on uh, all of the sentient beings and, and may they have uh, may they have happiness and lack any uh, sort of obstacles uh, to their uh, joy and happiness and uh, may all the actions uh, that all sentient beings do always fall in uh, into the kind of virtuous side of life <laughs> And and so very uh, grateful to all of you again for uh, joining and listening and thinking about these things. And uh, very specifically to uh, all of the people at Lama Zopa Rimshe's uh, uh, Dharma Center here, the Tashita and all of the, the staff and members here who uh, you put in tremendous effort uh, through days and months and years of uh, organizing uh, courses and events such as uh, Vajra, Vajra Sattva and all the other courses that they do uh, and that um, you know, helping to create a, uh, to, to uh, sort of clear away a negative, you know, negativities and to uh, create great uh, merit. So I, I am tremendously grateful for you all for doing this and, and rejoice in your activities. <laughs> Tachi <laughs> And so um, I, I apologize to any of you if you've come here and uh, you, uh, you feel that um, things that I've said were a, a little bit of a waste of your time or they didn't really have uh, any, um, uh, any sort of, uh, there weren't any strong reasons that really struck you uh, from, from what I've said. Um, 
Um, but I, everything I say is, uh, comes out of my experience and my, uh, and I say that, uh, you know, I, sincere, I, I sincerely um, have presented what I feel. I don't, I never, uh, I didn't receive a, a, a great spiritual education uh, in the texts and things like this, but uh, I say it from, uh, sincerely from my mind, uh, from from my experience, and because uh, those gone so chalky, and the, and also through the great gratitude of uh, the blessing of uh, His Holiness the the Vajradhara. So, um, so I thank you very much for being thank here. Thank you. <laughs> Uning Hundu Pebarajo, Tony Dava Rimbo, Jemaja Vanaji, Jeva Namba, Mevaya, Kuning Hundu Pebarajo, Dagi, Tuzon, Geva, Narandi, Jimmy Magu, Sison, Sanjay Malu, Sanjay Tobi, Junior G, Jeva Gundo, and Dalamanda, Jimmy Chiji, Bella Longi, Sadalanji, and the Raza. Doji Changi Gombon Yur Dojo Gewandi Jog Sona Ishe Tozo Sona Ishe Lenjo Tamba Kuni and Tobarishu Dumbanji then consuming Chimba Demba Nish in the Suma Dinji Punish in the Tumba Demba Yurin Ebe Jashi Shu Pedan Zoa Mungu Ijin Obo Pansanji Simjerova Gonzu Somebody
Thank <laughs> you.